Welcome to Nintendo Ninja News. I'm your host, Chris Tyson. So, what we are looking at today is Xenoblade Chronicles X, and I'm still getting used to the um, to the uh, setup of game recording and things like that. So this is uh, at night time. So let's have a look at some of the lovely places of Xenoblade Chronicles X. This is my uh, setup. God Zord and Power Zord, all sort of power ranges. Look. So. All level 60 now. After a year since we uh, did that two hour video, which was very cool. And this is how I've turned out to be, which is very nice. There's my gear. Which is not too bad, some of the weapons are okay. I could definitely do better. In terms of uh, level 60s and that now. A um, couple of them are maxed out. Burning Slash is very nice. Rising Blade. They're all pretty much are very much attack based. I suppose for the arts and the skills. Um, boosting attacks and physical damage and that. Which is uh, always very helpful. And your soul voices, uh, which is very good for battle. So I'm pretty happy about that setup. Skill Gill, not the most powerful one you can get, but I like him. Some very nice, powerful weapons. Busters, 33,000. Wow. So you get a bit of an idea about uh, If you did miss some of that, you can always pause the video and uh, have a look at things. But it is at nine time, which I'm a little bit annoyed at with the game. There we go. Ah, oh, we won't board it. So I know that guys. Oh, I've forgotten some of the Have a look at another world. So we're just showing off um, 
the, the different worlds that I like in the game. Which is very cool. So I'm getting back into gameplay. I'm on with the old um, headset. Um, microphone. The one that I used before, about six months ago or more, for Nintendo Engineers. There's a, you know, you don't notice it, but there is a lot of stuff on the screen, which takes up a lot of space. Um, but then again, my TV is the TV I'm using is only 32 inch, so it's not wide. So it's not. sorts of items which are uh, very very useful and handy. which is quite a lot, um, so I don't run out. The overall world looks very nice this time. the level 50 because I think I may have so in the game it is late at night 2.30 a.m. in the morning so that's the uh, in-game clock Silly little creature thing. Um, a little annoying. But, um, what are the options I've got? There's your missions. I have still a lot that I could do. But I think once I reached level 60, that was like, that's the end of the game for me. different options that you can do Intel inventory. All the different minerals that I own. Which are helpful for building things and weapons and stuff like that. So it's it's pretty good. Oh this is in the inside the cave, isn't it? This was well done. Nice spot. And online you have um, the squad member achievements and missions and things like that, which I you know they could build up more uh, later on.
Let's go and attack. Damn the enemies. Good oh, oh, very nice. That's unique. Such a bad weapon. Whoa. That is the morning time. Let's go back to, um, Ice World, which was very cool. And um, I've been pretty pleased about the way that... Um oh, this looks better. During the day it looks much nicer because it's not so dark, you see more of the light. And things like that. But just, you know, for something for this to be achieved on the Wii U is quite stunning. So. So you can see that this is much nicer during the day. Uh, the icy wall, look at that. It's brilliant. Let's take you to the third one that I liked. Which I was trying to show off before, but... <coughs> looked a bit funny, didn't it? I spent, um, I would say over 120 hours on this game, like, in a month. It was insane. Mm 
let's destroy this. Gets a bit gets a bit too easy at level 60, I think. I think it's still very powerful enemies up to level 100. Finding it. Can't attack or do much. Oh man! Ouch. Let's get rid of the and the big. No, we didn't knock it out. like the characters after a battle and uh, that's not too bad but this is another beautiful world and the last one we'll go to before we uh, switch off proceeding uh, procedures and um, say that we've done our first gameplay video for the year is um This is a, a lovely little world too. Uh, some great uh, arts of work here. To see around here, yeah. They've done a really great job of creating the world here. <coughs> So I hope you've enjoyed this little video uh, piece here, and it is a wonderful uh, sort of universe, isn't it? And I'm I'm very I I still think it's one of the best games on the Wii U, and I'm still very proud of uh, the game and you know how it all turned out, and how much I enjoyed it uh, th this time last year. So. That's the gameplay video for now, and I shall see you next time, Nintendo Ninja fan.